Welcome back to a brand new YouTube video here on It's Polar, and today we are teaching you how to make a row racing or really any racing uh, automatic standings thing with Google Sheets. Um, so before we get into it, be sure to like and subscribe, and let's get into it. So once you've opened up a new spreadsheet, you're going to get uh, something that looks like this, obviously. So what I like to do is I like to start making a nice design. So I like uh, go to the A cell, go to this uh, line here, that, and then uh, drag this over once it shows this arrow. And drag it to a nice narrow length like this. And uh, you can kind of start out like that, or anything you want. So say the league has like, I'm just going to do this, and I'm going to shade it a good color to uh, have some design like gray. So what I'm going to do then is do the same on the top, just do a random amount here. And then I'm going to make some headings here. I'm going to give it a border. This is just styling this. I'm going to call this the driver, so it's going to be the driver name category. Here is the total points category, and then it, race 1, race 2, race 3, race 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So let's say this season had 8 races in it, then I'm just going to do a decline here. And if you want to make it even, click on the um, column, and then right, and then hold down, control, CTRL, and then you can drag these and make them the same size. All right, so next I'm going to put some uh, styles on here. I'm going to make this bold and center the row two, and then I am going to give this some border. And yeah, so then you can add uh, more designs so on the bottom here. I'm going to give this this type of border as well and I'm going to do all caps here and I'm just going to basically here signify uh, certain uh, rounds here so I'll merge these cells I'm going to call this regular season so this range here can define the regular season I'm going to merge this cell and call it the round of six say our league had a round of six in the playoffs and then here I'm going to call this champ for the champ race. And I'm going to bold and center these. And I'm going to apply some color. I'm just going to do gray for this. For the driver, I'm going to do that color, uh, neon green. And then for the regular season, I'm going to do yellow. For the round of six, orange. And this will make your uh, thing, your uh, standing thing, look a lot nicer. So I'm going to select K or D through K. And I'm just going to size these um, so they're the same because these are only going to display point values. And I'm going to just, uh, you can, I'm just going to put to be decided TBD for this. And I actually want all this centered in here, so I'm just going to center it. And for you, you can put in all your driver's names here and uh, in this right here. And then for the total points... We're going to give this a nice highlight color, nice uh, dark greenish color there. And this will show the total points. I'm going to bold this as well. You know, CTRLB. And yeah, so next we're going to get into the stuff that actually will uh, function the automatic standings part of this. So, what you're going to want to do is locate the equal sign on your keyboard like that. And uh, I'm going to Press that, and then you're going to do capital S-U-M. Then in parentheses, you're going to want to do, uh, so here is D, the D column, row 3. We're going to do D3 through, do the colon to signify through, K3. And you'll notice it highlights the range. So what it's doing here is it's taking the sum of D3 through K3. So it's going to put the sum of those in this uh, cell. As you can see, nothing's in there right now, so I'm just going to uh, put that like that, and uh, I'm also going to do TBD here, because we're still going to be deciding these uh, races coming up. And by doing this autofill handle here and dragging it all the way down, it will copy the function. If you do the control and then the key next to, to the left of one usually, 
you're going to see here that it lists the function that it is. Notice how it is just copying the thing down. Once you do the autofill, undo that. Press that key again. So say this driver, so let's just put, say this driver in three points, you'll notice it changes. I'm just going to enter some random numbers here to kind of make this look good. Pretty unrealistic, but uh that's what you can do so in order to show that this works you can just uh do this and notice how the values change each time so you'll see that and it's automatic you don't need to add you don't need to jot down everyone's points in a discord or on a or on a document just enter how much points they earned in that race the drivers can see how much points they got and you don't even need to calculate it. it automatically goes up so it's a win-win for everyone here so we're almost done with this season here and uh, I'll, I'll show some examples of what a finalized product would look like because I have done this for multiple leagues um, so we're almost done here and but you might be like well how do I I don't want to change all these columns to sort it so uh, what you're gonna do is you're going to um, oh, did not mean to do that let's get this out of here anyways what you got what you can do is right click on the column C which is where we have our total points and you can look down and where it's a sort sheet Z to a click that and it will automatically sort your uh, cells by that but unfortunately uh, this is an Excel, so I'm not sure if there are like uh, advanced sort options where you can select from a certain range and right click and then just sort those. I'm not sure if you can do that or not in this, but you can pretty much just select the row and then just drag it down to then reapply your borders and stuff. And there you go. So that is how you do this. And we can also add some more design. I'm going to make this text um, blue. And you can just go down here and enter what position they're in. And you gotta update this update this every time though. And that right there is how you do an automatic point system for any league right there. I'm gonna show you an example of one of my leagues to see a nice product of it. Alright, here is a uh, point system I got. So here for a row racing league. Here we got the driver names. We have a playoffs cut line. We're only six races through. I highlighted these cells yellow to show that they won the race. And it is sorted like this. And you can see all the driver's points. This highlight right here shows that they either left the league or got banned. But they're still part of the season, so they're still put on the standings. Over here I got just some random stuff there that it's not supposed to be paid attention into but uh yeah so we got the points that you're in each race it's a close battle for the playoffs here two points separated and uh, yeah so this is how you do it right here on the side shows like their exact standings number like with the tied points and here is just like the standings position without the tide here is that styling we said here's going to be the round of eight the round of six champ race it it, it makes it look better just think if this wasn't here it would look pretty uh, boring, so you should always add that type of style into it. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Hopefully this helped you. Hopefully you're in a league and you, well, this will not stress you out as much. Make Typing up a whole uh, thing every after each race, this is very, very easy and simple to do. So I hope you enjoyed this video. We'll see you next time. Goodbye.